All right, guys, welcome back. Is my mic working? Yes, it is, but it's kind of falling off its stand here. One second. There we go. All right, welcome back. We uh, finished chapter five after much confusion and gnashing of teeth. Now we are now on uh, chapter six of King's Quest Seven. So let's see if we can wrap this game up and give old uh, King's Quest Eight a try. As you may or may not know, King's Quest Eight was the last King's Quest game made by Sierra, I believe. And it was the first game in 3D, which was a little, uh, how do we say this? Shitty? <laughs> I started it up because uh, I was just curious to see how it played, and man, the 3D graphics are awful. Terrible, terrible, terrible. Hey, Sean, what's going on? Hold on, let me minimize the screen so I can actually see chat on uh, Twitch here. Happy Thursday. Hope things are going well. I have been developing, I don't know if I ran into Poison Ivy or Poison Oak or something uh, on Sunday, but I have been getting a slow and uh, just basically just a rash. So I'm gonna go see the doctor tomorrow. It's very, very itchy and I haven't been sleeping well, but it's not killing me. So we're just gonna go ahead and stream. Plus we got, you know, we gotta get through King's Quest Eight. Okay, let's continue the game. Intro. Okay, so this is where we left off. Oop. So we use the... What do we use? We use this. The magic wand. And we were able to get rid of the fake prints because if you click this, it changes the F to a T. No idea. Had to look it up. Heat rash? Uh, possibly. Possibly could be a heat rash, but I don't... I don't know. I don't know, I've got the, I don't know what you call it, that pink lotion stuff that's anti-itch cream. Cardi, cardio something. But, uh, yeah, I'm gonna go see the doctor in the morning and make sure it's nothing, like, super serious. But, uh, yeah, he, it could be a heat rash. I have never gotten a heat rash before, though. Okay, so we are down in the volcano. We have to figure out what we need to do. I'm guessing this is timing-based, because we're probably going to die here soon. Right? If I don't do anything? Possibly. Hmm. Uh, hold on. Let me get rid of listener mode. Since there's no actual dialogue, let's remove that. There we go. Okay. Uh, clearly we have to use an item. Oop. Uh, what did we just get? What? Did we just dig a hole in the volcano? That's interesting. Alright, cool. We just made our own passage. Oh, back to the queen. Ooh, sound effects. Shazam! Oh, so that's where we're at. Okay, so she's back at the graveyard, so I guess we gotta meet up, right? Something along those lines? Yeah, because we can't even go back, so we have to go this way. Alright, linear. I like it. I don't have to think. Have you been playing any games lately, Sean? Oh, this cave. Okay, I think it was cave back in the desert. You got dimmer switches for this door. Okay. Oh! Oops. That got me. Did that kill me? No. Not really. Yeah, I've been playing a little bit of, uh... Well, I stopped playing Destiny 2. I went back and started playing Dauntless since they switched over to Epic Games and revamped a lot of their uh, UI. It's... it's fun. It's fun. Uh, I got tired of Destiny 2, so I, I stopped playing that. The grind for equipment is just too too boring for me. Alright, let's figure this out. What do we have to do? What if I just click? What if I do that afterwards? Hmm. Maybe I gotta use this somewhere? No. Extra life? No. 
Hmm. I don't think any of these items are useful. Destiny 2 is going to be free to play on Steam. Really? Uh, the base game or the base game with all the expansions? Because I got the base game for free last, uh, last Christmas. And then I paid for the expansions. Uh, is there anything else we can interact with here? Huh. Was there some sort of, uh, some hint here that we needed? Yeah, that's the only way we can go. Uh, maybe there's something I'm missing. Let me, let me look at our items here. See if that gives us a clue of what we need. We still have this apparatus. Mysterious device. Yeah. Hmm. I mean, those two are blue. Maybe they correspond to the eyes. I don't quite know. Destiny 2 does need to go free to play, honestly. It's uh, not a sustainable game. There's just not enough content, I feel like. And maybe they're just losing people. Like some of those raids and uh, in-game content require six players. If you don't have a population, you're screwed. Uh, okay, let's let's hit this twice. See what happens. If I keep hitting it, does it eventually? All right. So okay, so it's a three. They charge for the expansions. Okay, that makes sense. Oh shit. Oh, it is time-based. Lava. Oh, I fought the lava and the lava won. I just should have moved faster. Yeah, I know. Okay. So maybe we have to do the eyes first and the nose? Was there a hint about this? I don't think there was. And I don't think there's anything we can look at. Nothing we can interact with, interact with besides the eyes and the nose. We can't use anything on this, right? No. Hmm. Uh, what is this extra life for? Okay, let's try left eye, right eye, nose. There we go. Oh, that's easy enough. Okay. Now we have to plug this in. Now we have to move the, the body somehow. There's a little outlet right there. They're adding cross saves across platforms. So PS4, PC players are going to be able to play together? Uh, shovel? No. Fragrant flower. Let's try the flower. That'll wake him up. Okay. Oh, did he kill us? Or he put a net around it? Oh, they saved the day. They're finally back together. My daughter. Oh, I thought I'd never see you again. Mama, I'm so sorry. I saw the castle and I jumped in to see and the troll king, I mean Edgar, well, he just... Edgar? Edgar. I think he's from the fourth game. Because he was a troll in the fourth game. her out of my way well I enslaved your little mind once don't think I'll be so kind this time never again Malisha whoa he has magic too oh Oh, 
Uh, what are we supposed to do here? Yep. Drat it. Well. I just should have been more decisive. Okay, so we have a limited amount of time to do this. So I'm not sure what we were supposed to do. I thought we were supposed to plug this in, but maybe I have to give him an extra life. Let's try that. Wand? Yeah, I tried the wand, but it wouldn't let me uh, use it on her. Sit through this cutscene every time. Ooh. My daughter. I'll make a bookmark as soon as uh, never Edgar gets uh, knocked out. Ed Edgar? Mama, Edward. So Edward. Sorry. I saw the castle and Edgar. Oh, Edgar. Never mind. It is Edgar. Clap, 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 clap. There's a switch here. No. Out of my way. Never again. That's a weird fight. All right, let's save it. Let's make a new bookmark. Now we can't fix it, we can't adjust it. Oh, there we go. The device on her. Drat it. Oh. I just should have been more decisive. That didn't work, or it kind of worked. Uh, return to old bookmark. There we go. Oh. Drat it. Huh. I just should have been more decisive. Okay, maybe it needs to be powered up somehow. Huh. Interesting. Drat it. I just should have been more decisive. So a lot of these puzzles in chapter six are timing based. Or not timing based, or you just have a limited amount of time. Hey Senor All Good Zorilla, what's going on, man? How have you been? How'd you enjoy your little bit of River City Ransom? Yeah, I meant to respond back, but yes, they did reuse the sprites from River City Ransom for uh, Super Dodgeball, which Super Dodgeball is another good game that I really enjoyed. Yeah, both are really fun games. It's funny how much they uh, rehash and reuse uh, a lot of graphics and uh, sound effects and just music in general for other games. Like, I remember the the last boss, the final boss for River City Ransom on NES, they used the Double Dragon uh, music from the first stage for the final boss, which I thought was interesting. All right, let's see. Yeah, it was fun. Yeah, good. glad you liked it. That was one of my favorite, like, all-time, like, NES games growing up. All right, let's figure this out. We have to use this mysterious device, but apparently it's not powered. So in order to power it, we have to do something to power it up before we use it against her. Hey, we are almost done with this game. We're on the very, very last chapter. Oh wait, uh, I forgot to use my bookmark. Now we got to sit through this cutscene. Yeah, we already have King's Quest VIII preloaded and tested out, and it works. But man, is it ugly. We're talking 1995 3D graphics. I may have overpaid. It was on sale at Good Old Games for like seven bucks. Come on. I'm just gonna fast forward through this dialogue since we've heard it before. Malisha. No. Come on. Let's go through this. 
Zap. Zap. Zap you. And now we gotta figure out something. Uh, how was the beach? It was good. It was very relaxing. Unfortunately, I don't know if I brushed up against poison ivy or poison oak or something, but like, since Sunday, I've been developing a rash on both my arms, so I'm going to see the doctor tomorrow morning. I actually took the day off because I, I could not sleep last night. It was so, so itchy. I kept getting up to put like the anti-itch cream on there, but it just wasn't helping. So, it's covered. You probably can't see it, but it's covered, you know, a lot of my arm here, and it's just super itchy. But uh, we'll see what the doctor says tomorrow. But yeah, overall, Beach was awesome. We played a bunch of board games, busted out this game called Captain Sonar, which is kind of like a like a modern, real-time battleship, and it requires eight players, but you can play with six, where you have four people on each side, and in real time, you're like plotting and moving your submarine around and powering up your systems and shooting at the other player. But it's all like hidden move. It's such a fun game. We only got to play it once, but God, I cannot wait to play that game again. Yeah, it sucks. Yeah, it sucks, but hopefully things will be better tomorrow. It is Friday. Okay, um, we have this mysterious device we can use against her, but it's not powered up or it's not working correctly. Yeah, so... Oh, nope, that doesn't work. Yeah. It doesn't do anything. I just should have been more decisive. All right, let's let's restore our bookmark here. That's faster. Okay. I don't think we can use anything. No, no, we can't. That's gonna kill us. Hmm. Yeah. So the mysterious device is what we need to use. We just need to figure out. Maybe I need to look at it. Maybe I need to power it up somehow. Maybe there's a button or something I need to use. No. Huh. I love board games. I have to go to board game conventions around. Oh yeah? Uh, have you been to uh, PAX Unplugged? We go to PAX Unplugged every year and we have a great time. I We have been board game fans for the last probably five or six years. Like, we started off with Munchkin, then we graduated and started getting into the other games. Settlers of Catan, Ticket to Ride, uh, Eldritch Horror, Arkham Horror. And, like, there's just been no stopping us. <laughs> I've actually had to slow myself down because I end up buying a lot of board games. And we just don't have enough time in the day to play them all. So now I'm starting to kind of reduce my collection down to games that we're guaranteed to play. You know, every time we have people over. But yeah, board games are so much fun. All right, we gotta figure this out. Am I missing something? Don't think so. Hmm, there's this green button here. I don't know if that's something, something, yeah. Hmm, sounds like me, never been to that one. Yeah, PAX Unplugged, it's a, uh, a knock, not a knockoff. Knockoff implies that it's bad. It's a, a spin-off of PAX East, or in PAX West, PAX South, which is like Penny Arcade, a uh, video game convention. They decided to make one strictly for board games, so they called it PAX Unplugged, and this is, this will be the third year. They, they, they started, uh, 2017, and, uh, they're based out of, uh, Philadelphia. They always hold the convention in Philadelphia, which is, uh, like a two, three hour drive for me. Not a bad deal. And the tickets are reasonably priced. Oh, man, what do we do, what do we do, what do we do? Okay, um... Yeah, I'm gonna die. Yeah, there's just not enough time. No. Nope. Drat it. Huh. Nope. I'll be lurking in out. Good luck. Alright, thanks, Rilla. Thank you for the lurk. Very much appreciated. Oh my god. No. Alright, what am Drat I missing? It. I just should have been more decisive. Hmm. I feel like I'm going to die several times before I figure this out. Hmm. 
Yeah. Uh, let's just try using all the items on Malisha. Nope. No. Drat it. Okay, let's turn our bookmark. Huh. Zap. Drat it. I just should have been more decisive. Hmm. What do we need to do here? It looks like I need to put it in this thing. Yeah, that just it doesn't do anything. Yeah, it's not powered. I just should have. I need to power this thing somehow. Oh, so I can power it. Hold on a second. Oh, there we go. Uh oh, it's gonna blow up. I don't know what that did. Let's try that again. Let's see. I guess that means it's fully powered. Yeah. Yeah, it doesn't look different at all. But being fully powered, I should be able to use it on her now. Okay, so let's start it from here. So it's this cutscene. job stopping the volcano. <laughs> oh, you see the little volcano symbol here? Go all the way down. Interesting little effect. Move this out of the way. I thought I'd never see you again. Mama, I'm so sorry. I saw the castle and I jumped in to see and the troll king, I mean Edgar, well, he just... Edgar? The hell? Hold on, my controller is stuck on something. Oh. There we go. Maybe. No. There we go. You'll not touch her. Out of my way, well... All right. Your little mind once. Never again. Now it's powered up. We should be able to nail her with this. Zap. Edgar! Edgar! All right, let's go. Let's go. Boom. Hey! We changed her up to a baby. Such a cute baby. There's her dog rat thing. That's poop. That's poop. Hmm. <laughs> Did not like the smell of that. One second, let me close this. Just notice my closet's open. So now I guess we can just talk and do regular things. Oh. What the hell? We thank you for saving our world, my lady. My son, Edgar? Was your son? 
Yes, he was first taken from us as a babe by an evil fairy named Lolote. It was your valiant daughter who freed Ooh. him, and we were a family once more. That was King's Quest IV. Then, then he vanished again at his own homecoming celebration. I know now it was all part of Malisha's evil plot. You monster! Monster! How could you? Hmm. No, my love, no. Whatever Malisha was, she is no more. Can't you see this is only an innocent babe? Something went terribly wrong with you, my sister. <laughs> Let us start over again. Come, Lady Valenice, Lady Rosella. We will take you home. Hmm. Raising the baby that killed their son. Wait, is this it? There's no way this is it. That could not have been all of chapter six. No way! No way! I should have just finished this last stream! Holy crap! That was so short! Maybe they ran out of money. Because <laughs> I started chapter 6 with barely any progress. And now I'm done? What? What? Alright. Well, um... Got music. Good thing I tested out King's Quest 8 and made sure it's working. And it took us 30 minutes. Land Beyond Dreams by Debbie Somebody. Hmm. Overall? I really like this game. Had some issues with some of the puzzles, but I have issues with puzzles in every point-and-click adventure game. Hmm. Voice auditions. That it? Special thanks to mom. Oh, they're thanking my mom. I mean, she didn't do anything with the game, but... Oh, that's it. Woo. That was... That was fast. So, chapter six took 30 minutes to beat. The credits took less than five minutes, which, you know, I'm not really complaining about. Credit sequences always take way too long. But yeah, wow. We beat King's Quest Seven. We are almost through the series. All right, let's go ahead and start up Ye old King's Quest Eight. This is going to be a trial. I heard this was not a great game, but in the interest in completing out the series, we're gonna go ahead and rock it. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and play the intro via YouTube because the intro does not work in the game. I've tested it out several times, or for whatever reason, it just doesn't.